Sometimes I, I wish it was a shorter distance. I wish I had a way to get here quicker, but you know, whatever it takes for me to get to church to be with my people of the Lord. Yvette was born with cerebral palsy. In 1992, she was hit by a car. That resulted in the removal of her left hip. Even with those limitations, she's made the journey to Faith Point Christian Center week after week for the past four years. She's real active at church. She's actually on our dance team. She's on our women's dance team. We, she danced last week. And she serves others and prays for others, and she's a really awesome giving lady. Yvette is so well known for her giving that members of the church decided to give back. Nine months ago, they helped her get her wheelchair into safe working order. They raised money to install lights and batteries that will keep her chair running on her long commute. Now that winter has hit, they want to take that idea even further. We have practice at night, we have church at night, we have things to do at night, and she wants to be able to come, so we're trying to raise money to buy her a handicap van. She can wheel right in, go to the stern wheel, everything's hooked up. The church is trying to raise $20,000 for that van. If they're successful, Yvette will be able to make it not only to church, but to places she couldn't go for a long time. It would also make it possible for me to work because right now the way the transportation is in the city of Waynesboro, I cannot hold a job because I wouldn't, no job is going to let you off exactly at five so you can catch a bus on time. Freedom really is what she's getting. Just what we take for granted every day, she's going to finally get to have again.